Hi guys, welcome to the Grow Hub. Today I'll be talking you through the Bowyer range. We've recently taken on this range of uh, aquatic products. We found them over the pond in China and uh, we were really impressed by their facilities. We met up with the guys there, five star setup, got a big tour of their facilities and from that meeting that day we decided that we wanted to take on their range of products. So um, <clears throat> what we have here in front of us is some of the range that they do that we've decided to stock. So we've got the uh, nutrient chillers, we've got some air pumps, some water pumps and uh, some nutrient heaters. So one of the things like I said when we went over to visit them um, we were really impressed by their facilities and one key thing for me was the, the level of professionalism and the lengths they go to to test their products. So when we were there we saw the production line and everything else but uh, we saw every single one of their products being tested. So any of the electrical items that you see here today we saw you know, the chillers being tested, we saw the air pumps being connected to the manifolds and then being working fully operational. We saw the air pumps connected to air stones, put in nutrient tanks, we could see they were bubbling away working. So it gave us reassurance that we knew that every single product that left their doors uh, was working uh, and ready to rock and roll when we took shipment of it here in the UK. So to go into a bit more detail, um, what we've got, we've got the nutrient chillers that we've decided to take on from Bowyer. Um, one thing that we aim to offer now is continuity of supply. Um, over the last few summers it's always been a bit of a struggle for us to get older chillers. So now we've got a new supply chain, we should be able to offer you guys uh, continuity of supply so you've got uh, these things ready for the summer. So they do uh, several sizes in the chillers, um, so we've taken on the L075, uh, the L200, the L350 uh, and the L500. They have um, a refrigerated capacity of between 80 litres and 1000 litres and they can rapidly cool uh, a nutrient solution from 35 degrees down to 18 degrees. Um, as you guys are probably fully aware, it's important to keep your nutrient temperatures in between the parameters of about 18 to 21 degrees um, so you don't have any problems. The biggest problem that's probably faced in this industry is pythium. So if you've got a high nutrient temperature, that's one problem that could occur. So it's important for, for a lot of growers to install a unit like this so you don't have those problems. Um, other products that, that we've taken on uh, are these high power air pumps. So this one here is uh, 4,000 litres an hour, but the range that we've taken on will go between 3,600 litres an hour and 6,000 litres an hour. Um, they come with these fittings here, so you've got a little brass fitting here uh, which is threaded and a little length of pipe. So that would thread in to the air pump, connect that piece of pipe onto this six-way manifold and then from there using formal airline you can then connect up air stones or whatever it may be. We've then got um, some slightly smaller air pumps. Uh, they do three different sizes. So we do two one-ways, we do a two-way and we also do a four-way. Uh, the two-way and the four-way and just one size of the one-way is adjustable and then we just have this single one which isn't. Like I said on the front, you just got a little nipple on the front there, so all you do is just connect some air line to that, connect your air stone, whatever else, and off you go. Um, we're also doing their range of water pumps, so this is just a small one we have here. So um, this one will do 120 litres, but we do do ones that go from 120 up to 6,000 litres an hour. Uh, they have a variable head range of 0.3 of a metre, to 5.2 meters. Uh, and the next thing we've also taken on uh, are these nutrient heaters. Obviously at this time of year it's bitterly cold and your nutrient temperature might be well down uh, into single figures perhaps. So it might be important for you guys to install a nutrient heater. So we do three different sizes. We do a 100 watt, a 200 watt uh, and also a 300 watt. And the temperature range is between 18 and 32. But like I said earlier, an ideal temperature range is going to be between 18 and say 22 degrees. So there you go, this is the Bowyer range. We've now got um, the majority of these items in stock. 
So we've got the, the chillers, the two air pumps, all the range of water pumps are in now, are in stock, and coming soon will be these little nutrient heaters. So there you go guys, get involved. <laughs>